A lot of Cowboys fans were probably surprised by the news that came up on their phones today. The Cowboys trading a fourth round pick for San Francisco quarterback Trey Lance. The former third overall pick by the 49ers in the 2021 NFL Draft. Since he was drafted, Lance has thrown just 102 passes, completing 55% of them for 800 yards with five touchdowns and three interceptions. By all accounts, everyone in the NFL seems to think that Trey Lance is a bust. Uh, I can't say everyone. I think a lot of 49ers fans liked him, but feel he didn't get a fair opportunity in San Francisco. Nevertheless, the Cowboys traded a fourth round pick for him. So what does that mean for Dak Prescott and the Cowboys this year and next year and maybe in the years to come. Let's talk about it. When Trey Lance was drafted out of North Dakota State, he was praised for his poise, toughness, and maturity. He was a locker room guy coming out of college and he still is. He was a top three overall pick for a reason, but for whatever reason, it didn't work out in San Francisco, and after a couple injuries and bad luck, Brock Purdy was named the starter, Sam Darnold the second string, and Trey Lance kind of left with what we're at right now, and that's being traded. Whatever the reasons are that he didn't work out as a 49er are all gone now. He's in Dallas, it's a fresh start for him, and an opportunity for the Cowboys to roll the dice on the most important position in all of sports, the quarterback. But what does that mean for their quarterback now in Dak Prescott? And I'm going to break the news to everybody. It means a whole bunch of nothing right now. Whatever ESPN is going to say tomorrow, this trade has nothing to do with Dak Prescott. And it has everything to do with the Cowboys quarterback two spot. In my mind, I think that the Cowboys thought that this would be a good dice roll on a quarterback two with really high upside. A guy that may be down the road could take over for Dak Prescott, but probably doesn't. Look at the Cowboys trading for a fourth round quarterback like this. If they hit and Lance does become the franchise guy in two years, that's absolutely awesome. You just got another franchise quarterback for a fourth round pick. If it doesn't work out, which is more likely, who cares? Personally, I love the trade for the Cowboys. I love it for Trey Lance. It's a fresh start for him. The Cowboys get a quarterback too with high upside. And the truth is Dak Prescott has missed time in each of the past three years. He missed two-thirds of the year in 2020, he missed a game in 2021, and he missed five games in 2022. Now, it looks like the Cowboys are going to keep three quarterbacks on this roster, with Rush being quarterback two and Lance being quarterback three. Nevertheless, you have a guy that could possibly be the reason you win games if Dak gets injured. Not a game manager, someone that can legitimately win you games. So now that we're done talking about Dak Prescott and what this means for him, let's look at Trey Lance. The truth is the guy has thrown 102 passes in his entire NFL career. Has he been absolutely magnificent? No, but he's thrown five touchdowns to three interceptions. He has an 84.5 passer rating, averaging 7.8 yards per attempt. So for the 49ers to just give up on him after two years, after him becoming a top three overall pick, is a bit strange. He could come in here with the Mike McCarthy West Coast offense and tear it up. I don't think the 49ers really gave him a fair shot to see if he was the guy. So maybe the Cowboys get to figure that out. Whether he's a franchise guy or a high quality quarterback too that could be a trade piece in a year. I like it because there's value maybe down the road. And the truth is your quarterback has been hurt each of the past three years. And it's a fourth round pick. Who cares? Let me know your thoughts on the Trey Lance trade down below. Below. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I love you all. Bye.